President Trump put new tariffs on imported solar panels this week. This comes at a time when the Texas solar industry is growing. In just the last three months, enough solar was installed statewide to power, statewide to power 44,000 homes. That's more, again, in the last three months than the state added in all of 2015. And as of 2016, the industry employed nearly 10,000 Texans. Ben Russell spoke to sources in that industry to get their take. He joins us now live. And Ben, who do they say will be impacted by this? Mark, we're told the bigger the project, the bigger the impact on this. So someone like you or I who wants to put solar on our rooftop would be impacted far less than, say, a customer like this. We're in the parking lot of the Dallas engineering firm Telios. They installed four massive solar topped parking canopies in their lot last year and paid a lot of money for it. But even they would be impacted a lot less than a utility company installing one of those massive, what you may have seen, solar farms. At worst case scenario, it's a speed bump on a road to our renewable energy future. That is Andrew Whitehead of Plano's Axiom Solar. He tells NBC5 this tariff is not good news for the solar industry in Texas, but it's not as bad as it could have been. For example, the 30% tariff will drive up the cost, but not a corresponding 30%. And even with the tariff, installing solar will still cost less now than it would have two years ago. However, anything that cools the market or concerns potential customers is a concern. That's according to the chair of the North Texas Renewable Energy Group, who's made public education about energy efficiency her career. I think that, you know, homeowners may, may be hearing this for the first time, and it may seem like a negative to them. The prices will tick up a little bit, but if you shop around and select your system carefully with regard to what your energy use is, and if you reduce your energy use, you'll come out ahead anyway. To be clear, no one in the industry who we spoke with fears as though this will be the sun setting on solar here in Texas. Perhaps it's worse, similar to the analogy made just a few moments ago. This may be simply a cloud passing in front of the sun's rays. Live in Dallas, Ben Russell, NBC5. All right, Ben, got it. There is at least one Texas solar manufacturer prepared to take full advantage.